Okay, folks, next we are going to do our roasted Brussels sprouts. And what we need to do first is when they come, they have a little bit of a stalk on there and a little bit of brown piece. I'm just going to take that off. And we have some boiling water with Saltopia's flake salt. Just going to toss these in here for a short amount of time. Without blanching with salted water, we're actually going to soften the sprouts just a little bit for four to six minutes, four to five minutes. And you can see the beautiful color that, that's starting to erupt from the, from the leaves. Okay, our Brussels sprouts are nearly done. We're going to drain these in a colander. The key is not to cook them for too long. And for our next step, we're going to use some of the bacon grease that we reserved early in the day when we made our beef wellington. And going to take our Brussels sprouts, simply put them in our pan, cover them up with some of our bacon grease. And actually, if people are adverse to bacon, this is a nice sneaky way of getting that smoky flavor in. A little bit of olive oil. We're going to use our Sweet Tart Saltopia salt. The primary flavoring component is sumac, which is a nice lemony flavor. A little bit of blueberry and balsamic vinegar as well. Real nice flavor combination, very, very unique. Toss these around. Let's finish with some shallot, some rosemary, some thyme. Nice herby flavor, a little more shallot. A little more olive oil. And these Brussels sprouts will go right into the oven. You can see how some of the leaves are coming off after we trim the stem. These get super duper crispy, super lovely, nice caramelized, really sweet. A little bit more herb on this. Straight into the oven for maybe 10, 12 minutes. The idea is not to overcook these. We can feel them when they start getting a little soft and we're ready to go.